Kev. You know, that was one hell of a defensive effort by your team here today. What did you like best about the way you played overall here on the road? A uh, really solid team game. I think that's what we were praying for the last couple couple games here, and I think it was a really solid effort against a, a team that's been that's been riding a real hot hand, and we definitely made it hard on them. Um, had really good chances. L played outstanding, and um, I think it was a really close game today. You know, what did you think, or what did you see on the game winner? Um, just a bobbling puck. I think we lost a little bit of our composure, um, and then, I mean, it's on a stick, it's off a stick, and it's in the back of the net. I mean, he's he's uh, he's hot. Uh, I think he had 10 points coming in in the last five games, so uh, it was we knew it was going to be hard stopping him, and obviously he was a, he was a difference maker today. I had a chance to talk with Joe Valeno between periods, and he said that your fight, uh, your first one in Philip Forsberg, obviously doesn't go a lot, but signified the intensity and the meaning behind this game. Uh, tell me what went into it from your perspective. Uh, I don't know. I just fumbled the puck a little bit, got cross checked, and then I don't know. We got uh, the best of our emotions. Um, in the end, uh, I think it was pretty, pretty enjoyable for everyone. Um, yeah, and obviously, uh, it's it's a lot of emotion that that uh, playing in that game right now, and. Um, I see we get, we've got to keep the standard high for that, and then I think we're giving ourselves a real good chance here for the for the for the reminder. What's your sense of the energy or the boost that it gave your team at the time? It was great. I think um, we just played really solid 60 minutes. Um, I think we deserved a little more tonight, um, but other than that, I think uh, we'll definitely recover from that, come back stronger, and um, uh, we'll be we'll be prepared for the next couple of games. Well, what do you? What did they do in their penalty kill to keep you guys off the score sheet on the power play? Uh, I think they did a good job of uh, defending the rush today. Um, they made it hard on the entries. Um, I think still we got pretty good looks. Um, I don't know. I think um, I don't think they do anything special. I think we just got to have a little bit more expectation uh, for ourselves. But as I said before, I think it was a, was a solid effort tonight, and we'll definitely score in the next one. A tight defensive. Tight defensive game too tonight. Just the intensity and the energy level, and how you guys can kind of build off that moving forward, and the environment that it's like this down the stretch here. Yeah, we have uh, I think 11 games left. Um, all of them are are playoff games for us, and if we bring that intensity, I think we'll we'll have a good chance of being in the playoff picture for a long time here. I was hoping to start at the uh, end and work backwards from that. Uh, what did you see in front of you as far as the game winner is concerned? Uh, yeah, just to, I mean, kind of a weird one of those where it's just bouncing all over the place and um, just a good good play by their their guy he got it in a kind of an unusual spot and he he, he swung it and he uh, he made a good shot so um, yeah it's just I thought we battled really hard all night and the the decor played played great and so uh, um, yeah just uh, haven't like obviously seen it or anything like that yet, so got to take a look and see what happened. But uh, I felt like a good play by a dangerous player. Yeah, and you guys held the hottest team in the league to one goal here tonight. The key has been to tighten up defensively. In what ways did you see your team tighten up defensively in front of you tonight? Oh, I thought the guys were great tonight. Um, passion and emotion and um, blocking shots. You know, Mo's always blocking shots, but uh, guys were awesome tonight. And I thought we were communicating really well in the D zone and I think that it's important for us and I think it makes the game simpler and cleaner. Um, and yeah, like you said, like they, they can really get buzzing in the offensive zone so I thought we, we handled that really well. You got four more games on the road against some pretty tough competition as well. What part of this road game do you need to bottle up and carry into each one of those? Yeah, I think, you know, you're, you want to win every game but ultimately what you're looking for is to play the game the right way. and. Um, and to just bring your best and have a good effort. And it felt like we had that tonight, you know, in a hostile building, good team um, that's obviously playing really well right now. So uh, just got to keep moving on and um, move on to the next one starting starting now. Guys like Forsberg and Mo throwing hands uh, this time of year just kind of show the intensity uh, of both teams going. going yeah, for sure. Uh, good, good fight, too. Uh, Obviously, those are two guys that you don't see, you know, doing that very often. But when they do, and it was intense too. So a lot of respect for for Mo for um, grinding like that, and um, it was it was it was passionate. You could feel it. So uh, yeah, you love to see it. Your first start in almost a week. How did you feel out there, just being back out? I felt good. I felt good tonight. 
felt uh, crisp and uh, calm and um, yeah just uh, played my game and um, again the the decor did an amazing job tonight so I got to give them a lot of credit. Next line, you see a tight one tonight. How pleased can you be with the defensive effort from your group? Oh, I love it. I mean, to come into a building like this and give up one goal, you're certainly going to give yourself a chance. And if you only get one goal, you're probably looking at a pretty good team effort. It's just really frustrating, disappointing that unfortunately it came down to one play, and we had it on our stick three different times. Uh, within that flurry, uh, it was kind of self-inflicted. A lot of positives, obviously, but just a huge missed opportunity for a point. A goaltending battle tonight as well. Alex Lyon, what your assessment of his game? Tonight? Excellent, excellent. Uh, he looked like himself when he had that long run there. He was under control, uh, looked sharp, looked good. You know, you got to tip your hat to Sorrows. That was a goalie steal win uh, for them. Um, you know, maybe a little bit more on us if, if obviously you're running into a goalie like that and uh, you can tell he's on his game, maybe a little more traffic, a little harder around that area. Mo Sider's first career fight tonight as well, just the spark that provided for the group and just his intensity brings the run. It, it was lifting. Mo plays with such an edge, um, and when you play with that type of edge, uh, there's going to be moments like that, and I thought he handled it extremely well. A really good sign for him going forward. Good. Thanks, Nuzi.